Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Damon Gonzalez from Latin Box Sports. We're back here at the Slip Punches show. Uh, today, uh, in boxing, of course, we're celebrating uh, the first fight of Arturo Gotti and Mickey Ward. Oh, man, that's some really great memories. Great memories of two warriors that uh, we admire and love both very, very much uh, for all that uh, individuals that have been around him uh, for so many years. Uh, big shout out to Irish Mickey Ward. Uh, Mickey Ward, know you're doing very well and your family's doing well. You know, shout out to all my friends, uh, uh, Kathy Duva, Jolene, you know, Buddy McGirt, everybody, man, all my buddies, uh, you know, Pat Lynch, you know, all you guys. I miss you guys, love you guys. Call Moretti, of course. You know, everybody that was part of the team back in the days. Uh, we have a special guest coming on any minute. Hopefully, we'll be able to work this out. And uh, we'll move on with the Slip Punches show. Uh, this is going to be very, very nice uh, for all of us. Uh, this special guest is a young man uh, in the amateur ranks, another amateur fighter that we have the opportunity to have on the air. We're trying to mix it up. You know, we're not just doing the pro fighters. Uh, we like to talk to everybody. We like to talk to the pros, the promoters, the cutmen, the trainers, the referees, the timekeepers, the amateur fighters, um, everybody that's involved in the sport. Man, we just love to talk to everybody. And the reason why, of course, is because – Latin Box Sports want to contribute to just keeping the message out to everybody, you know, uh, just keeping the sport alive. Keep on punching, keep on communicating, keep this going, you know, because this is this is motivating for everybody. I spend hours online uh, listening to other people's shows and listening to my colleagues, Supreme Boxing, you know, listening to the podcast of Front Proof Media, just, so, you know, my boys at Sidestep Boxing, you know, Will. You know, just listen to the different shows and just, you know, just being a part of, you know, because that's what it's all about, man. You can't keep it if you don't give it away. Yeah, that's the way it is, man. It's just an awesome, awesome thing. So let's see if we can get this fighter to join us. Okay, here we go. We got him aboard with us. All right. Ladies and gentlemen that are joining us on the Flip Country Show, we want to welcome Arturo Gotti Jr. Arturo. Hi, how are you? How you doing, my friend? I'm good, and you? I'm doing well. Thank you so much for joining us on the Slip Punches Show. It's Thank it's you. really awesome, super awesome to have you join us with us today. Um, I want to ask you, how are things going up in Canada? How is you and your family doing, of course, with this coronavirus happening? Are you guys safe? Yeah, we're really, we're, we're good. And, um, yeah, we're, we're blessed to, 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 to have a good life. And, uh, yeah, nothing bad is happening. Yeah, nobody has the coronavirus. So good. good. Well, we're so happy to hear that. Well, let's let's talk about you. For the past couple of years, you've been really making a lot of noise in amateur boxing. You've been doing very well for yourself. Talk about how your career has been going to this point. Well, it's 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 um I had my first fight in uh, April in April and um no, you I, have your first fight in December. And then the April was canceled because yeah, of the Yeah, I had my first fight. It was in December um, 24. And um, I was supposed to fight in April, but, uh, but the, fight, the fight got canceled because of the coronavirus. Well, you've competed in a couple of tournaments already. I saw online that you won those fights. You did very well. You and your trainer, the chemistry. Talk about the chemistry, how that's going with you and your uh, trainer. It's going good. Um, my my coach, his name is Mo. I train in the N80, Ring 83 boxing gym. And um, it's really it's really good and it's fun. And yeah, I have a lot of fun. So it's definitely no secret. You want to carry the torch. And your vision is to become a pro fighter one day? 
Talk about your goals. What do you want to accomplish? Um, I want to be the best boxer ever. And for sure. Yeah, that's it. Now, you definitely have some for a young man, and I've seen it on video, and one day soon, hopefully, to see it live. You have some really quick hands. Boy, that reminds me of somebody. My father? Yes. <laughs> Aturo, today's the anniversary of your dad's fight with Mickey Ward. First fight. You have any thoughts and comments about that fight, that legacy fight? Well, the first fight versus Mickey Ward, it wasn't my perf uh, my favorite fight. My favorite fight versus Mickey Ward was uh, the second fight. Yes. I was actually ringside. Um, work in that fight i think i yes i was shooting photography in the third fight and i was ringside in the second fight when you see that fight on youtube and you watch it what are your thoughts watching that fight do you see do you see yourself in the ring well yes for sure so tell me um as a young fighter mm -hmm. fighting growing up in boxing how much do you love boxing? And definitely talk about this dream that you have to, to be a world champion one day. Um, well, boxing is my favorite sport. I already tried a bunch of sports like uh, tennis. But I, I do basketball. I, I still play basketball. Um, I used to have basketball courses, but now I don't have them because of the coronavirus. I play basketball, but for sure, boxing is my favorite sport. And then, um, yes. That's what I'm going to do for, the, for a living. Aturo, um, the tools of war, boxing equipment. Big shout out to Rival Boxing. I know this in your videos. You love wearing the boxing gloves from Rival. How do the gloves feel on you? You feel strong? Is, is your work good? Let's talk about that. Well, um, Rival, um, for now, it's like my favorite gloves. It's the gloves that I use for training, for for punching the bag, for sparring, everything I use rival. And um, yes, it's a it's a good brand and everything. It's a, yeah, it's a really good brand. And you like Ross too. Yeah, Russ Amber. Yeah, he's a really good guy. Maturo, right now, stay in the sport of boxing. Do you have any who are your favorite fighters? Name a couple fighters today that are fighting that you like a lot. That wow, I like that fight. Um Javante Davis. Tank? Yeah. Oh, wow. Nice. Javante Who else? Davis, Ryan Garcia. Okay. Kingry. Wow. It's impressive. Um, Garcia. Who else? John Pascal. Ah, John Pascal. Yes. WBC um, champion. Yes. Um, what's his name? Um. Uh, I don't have a lot of fighters that are like that. Like, um. Well, I'll tell you what, Atura, we we're so delighted to have you on the show with us. And we hope in the near future that you would join us in future shows as we continue, you know, to follow your career as a young amateur fighter. Atura, how how can the fans reach you on social media to follow you? Uh. Uh, like your Instagram and all that. Yeah. Well, uh, my father's fans, they, uh, they, uh, they support me a lot. And uh, yes. Very good. Thank you so much, Arturo. We appreciate you coming on the show again. And you keep on punching, young man, okay? A lot of people are backing you, supporting you. We love you to death, okay? Thank you thank so you much for joining us. You're, you're welcome. Thank you. Say thank you to all the fans that follow you. Yeah, thank you for all the fans that follow me. Thanks for the support and everything. Um, God bless. Thank you, Turo. God bless you. Take care. Bye. Bye-bye. Well, guys, thanks again. Uh, Damon Gonzalez and Latin Box Sports. We have Turo Gotti Jr. on the line with us. Such a great young kid. 
Uh, I love his father, the pieces. Um, it was just uh, emotional. And at the same time, great having him aboard with us this afternoon to reach out and connect with the fans out there. And we thank you again for following us. We'll see you guys in a couple hours.